Hello, old market simulator. So in this game, you just take these like um, resources and stuff for selling on the market. And then I think this is like NPC giving due to them. So you just have to bring them, like make the orders, like um, quests kinda. And maybe you can even open your shop or something. So this is 780. Sumo tanks. So it's like a PvP game, like with tanks, you can also play it against AI. And I don't know if there's power-ups, there are some kind of power-ups that spawn. So you just have to knock each other like out of this, like a boundary, right? And whoever stays the last wins. There's a free diamond, it's 585. The method of hiding a body. This is like a horror, right? Um, It's not tagged as horror, but it should be horror. And it's like a puzzle adventure. And wait, you climb there, so it's like a cat. You play like a cat or not? No, this is like a flash that you play like a normal human. Um, so I guess you just go through the dark caves and try to like hide the bodies. So this is five. Venture to the vile. Okay, it's kinda like adventure platformish. It's like a two and a half D, there's these like a boss fights and there's like spikes and stuff so you have to touch them and like you have different abilities, you have this like a grappling hook and stuff. Um okay looks good. There's a free diamond, it's 2205. Tiny machinery rust reality. So this is like a point and click, it's like one of those um puzzle games where there's like a multiple puzzles in this like a cube and then as you spin it like you get the close and then you need to open it completely and find the exit and then you go to the next one it's 339 friendship island action adventure first person shooter okay so it's kind of like um old like doom looking shooter like fast paced there's no cursor so you have to know where you're shooting and you have all kinds of different weapons and bunch of zombies and animals attacking you. This is 975. Holy Clash cards. This is a card game, turn based. And so you can deploy five cards, they have their mana cost, and then you can attack wherever. And they probably have their own abilities or something. Okay, this is 299. Please be kind to the chickens. So this is a puzzle game where chickens follow, you play like a yeti and then chickens kind of follow behind you and then you have to get them to the finish line, like to the to the tile that has a chicken drone, or like they're like escaping, oh they're like escaping from you so you have to um pull the boxes and make them so they bounce from the boxes and go to the finish line, okay. There's a free diamond, it's 1342. A real card. Okay, so you can assemble your own card, like piece by piece, screw by screw, and color it and make it however you want, and then you can try it. And then there's tracks, and um, is this a single player? Also PvP. Um, okay. And it's 67.99. Oof, inflation hits hard. Battle for the Crystals, action RPG, difficult pixel graphics, so this is kind of like survivor or like an idol survivor, so when you level up you can pick like a new um, units and then there's this like a power up menu where you spend gold to get more bonus stats, um, yeah these upgrades and I can't tell much more. So this is 149. The Battle of Baldur. PvE shooter, third person shooter. Why is it controller tagged? Is it like first controller? It's not. Please don't be controller. So you can just destroy everything and enemies so like crates and are you like defending or something? There's like a health bar at the top. I can say just killing a bunch of enemies. Um and then there's all kinds of different weapons, but this is just cinematic. It's, it's probably like level based or something. Okay, there's a free demo and it's 1755. Dungeon Riddle. 
So it's a mystery dungeon hidden object. So you have to walk around the dungeon, pick up these like portions and keys and just to go find the door where the key belongs to. And there's lots of traps. Solve the mysteries. So if it's if it was like slightly dark, it would be a horror, right? Okay, it is 879. Rollscape. Strategy roguelike casual. So you keep rolling the dice and then there's numbers that keep appearing at the bottom. I have no idea what what's happening. So you can change the face of the dice and every time you roll, like these numbers appear, but I don't know how like. So you have limited the number of rolls. You probably need a tutorial for this game because I have no idea how like they calculate these like numbers at the bottom. Okay, so this is 620. Third year, casual arcade 2 d So you play like a bird and then you have to go get the food for your um, offsprings. And you probably have to defend also from these eagles and stuff. And there's different levels like seasons, there's different birds. So yeah, you can attack like predators and defend your nest. So this is 119. Captain Stu, so this is two and a half T. You play like this captain, it's like a platformer, you can jump on the enemies to destroy them. Probably move the boxes. Can you move the boxes? They didn't move the box. Um Okay the combat is wonky. You have to kill this guy like to hit him five times to kill him and like it, it doesn't get staggered or anything and you can't even dodge. Okay. This is six eighty nine. Isles of Sea and Sky. Okay, so this is like a top-down pixel graphics mythology. So there's like lots of puzzles. You can destroy the blocks and find the keys. And like you have to collect these like a diamonds. And is this like a boss fight? That looks like a boss fight. Um, and then you can push these like a teddy bears or whatever they are. But those creatures are just like a blocks. And then you can explore this like um, sea. You need like an unlimited limited number of these stars, I guess, to progress to the on the sea. And then there is this like a waves that to push the blocks in like specific direction. Yeah, lots of puzzles. Okay, it's seventeen fifty five. Sunrise order. So this is like a farming simulator, right? You can. Um, make the crops, plant the plants, and you can also fish, you need to water the plant, there's like a mini games, and you're fishing, so there's like a contract, and then you just need to totally deliver whatever um, plants they need. This is 1399, Dash Lab, okay, so you play like this glowing orb, and then you can dash, or like just go normally through the like objectives then you have to collect whatever you need to collect there's like different stuff to collect and then get to the finish line when you collect everything and then do it in the shortest time possible and then there's also obstacles those red ones and these cannons are probably obstacles there's a free demo and it's 879 fixer stair okay so you have to fix something there's this like an old tv and stuff there's you play like this robot um, there's like lots of text, so it's like a story based thing. Um, it says visual novel, so you don't actually like fix anything yourself, you just answer these questions and like pick the dialogue, and then that's how you fix stuff. And then if you choose the wrong one, like you don't fix stuff. Okay, there's a pre demo, and it's 975. Oros. Okay, this game is interesting. So you have like this whatever shape and then you have um, these like uh, numbers and then your shape has to like go this ball that's spinning in your shape has to go through all the numbers like in order where the numbers are placed. So you have to drag and reshape your shape. Um, and this is interesting. And then you have portal to like 
just teleport to the other part and then you can make all kinds of different like drag it, stretch it however you want okay this is 399 lost in tropics this is survival so action adventure and just like any other survival get the resources then you can craft stuff you can also fight the crabs and you probably also have to cook fish around for stamina and food and like also thirst and you need to spray these like fish that are attacking you like a flying birds okay this is 769 harvest hunt this is survival horror okay so you have a pitchfork in like a, this not flashlight but how is it called lantern yes and then you go around and um you can loot axe on like a stuff with like a bomb and then there's like some cards that you can use to help you and you probably have to like run away from whatever is chasing you okay, this is 1486 rkgk Rakugaki. This is action adventure single player anime. Okay, so you play this anime character, you can punch um, enemies. It's like kind of colorful. Like you kind of spray paint on them or something. And it's also like platformer ish. You can collect coins, and yeah, this platform disappears. There's lots of traps. You can wall jump you can dash and kind of glide midair looks nice cover that was boss that those like bunch of like bullet that floated and lasers yeah lots of boss fights okay this looks decent it's 17.99 necromantic this is bullet hell hack and slash so it's like a survivor just kill everything get experience and then uh, pick up new upgrades and then you can also do it in co-op this is a boss fight okay this is 689 block pieces 3d jigsaw puzzle okay so you have a puzzle in like these cubes and then you, you need to spin the cubes or like switch their places and then get everything where it belongs and complete the picture okay this is 199 slam and roll is this like a pvp game or like a co-op so you have one kind of attack like you throw some kind of balls like baseballs or something and it's kind of like a platformer also and i can't tell what's enemy here so you need to kill the enemies and then they drop something and then you need to pick up whatever they drop it's like a for points and there's also like a bonus levels um and there's like a this like a mini boss fight or something and then you need to rescue some characters and then there's a bunch of different levels okay there's a free demo and it's 989 spready okay so this is like a puzzle game you have this block and then you have to color so you every time you move on the white tile this number on the colored block goes down so you just need to color everything and reduce these numbers to zero then you can also like spin these buttons to find the white spots because you can only move on the white spots okay looks interesting there's a free demo and it's 2.99 and those are all paid games for today links to steam storage for all these games are in the description okay see ya